Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Goldcrest Valley. Woohoo! 19. Goldcrest Valley 19, folks. Anyway, I'm your host with none. Huh, not the most. Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, I'm proud of this machine. I, I really am. Um, we're, we're fixing to get started. Not why I talk to y'all while I'm working. Um, first of all, how y'all do it? Y'all doing all right? I hope you're doing great. Um, well, we've I ain't got but a few trees completed. As you can see there, it looks kind of bare. This is a contract, in case y'all are new. Uh, this contract's going to cost us, well, not going to cost us, it's going to make us fifty thousand dollars and uh some change well just fifty thousand yeah but we got some other equipment we're testing out so sit back relax and i hope y'all enjoy how these out here by the road um we also got a sawmill loan that i've been taking out in case y'all are new I'm fixing to flop that in right now. Yeah, that's how much we owe the sawmill is in debt for the equipment, which y'all will see. It's uh, right over there. We'll see it here in a second. I promise. Well, I'm not going to promise. Usually when I promise, something something happens. And I, I don't get to do it. I uh, got some storms approaching in real life, folks, and uh, so don't know how long I'm going to be recording. Uh, finally felt like recording again. I'm sorry for that little break there. I don't know what you um, Thought I had a video for yesterday and come find out I didn't. And yeah, and uh, I went outside to fix my truck. I had to replace the battery on it and the, my science has got to go folks well what am i doing lay off my button or something but yeah i went outside changed swap my batteries out after i went and got one and it, it just it tore me up I, what about what 20 minutes out there and my eyes was watering itching and, started sneezing and I'm like oh whoa 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 get off there and I'm just like you know I gotta mow my yard too and I, I just dread dread that time all right we we got like three trees left looks like now I got the stump grinder grinding as we go taking out these stumps it's helps for it being on this machine that we're, we just don't have to go back and redo anything it's just right there with it you know saves a step whoa on a lot of these I don't have to close the arms on the thing but these bigger ones I have to help keep balance it's just yeah it's, it's a nightmare with these big ones but it handles it pretty good. It just you gotta make sure you get it closed just right. Um after this I don't know if we'll have any big contracts. Uh nobody's called and, and needed anything cut, so I I don't know you know we got all this big machinery and I was hoping we'd get some more contracts but you never know maybe something pops up and, and plus we got some things around the farm we need need to cut and stuff make some more room raise up for fence Whew. I always get my camera angle off and and everything. I'll go ahead and get this other big one here and then I'll get the little one. Well yeah, uh, 
other than that, I had to update my OBS. It's calling for another update, so I hope it's going good. Did I get that stuff? Look like it could, yeah. All this tree would be in the way. But, uh, yeah, I hate doing OBS updates because at one time kind of scarred me for life. I changed my controls and stuff. You know, hey, why, why are you changing my controls? I mean, you're just doing an update, but I hopefully got everything that's showing it's recording. And all my bars and stuff are going when I'm talking and stuff. So I didn't do a test, which I got burnt on that too for not doing a test. Let me switch to my grinder and raise it up. This kind of helps on the ground there, not being so rugged. All right, that was our last. No, we got the get the baby tree to go, don't we? Yep, one last tree to go. I think I just parked the machine over here till we get done loading this stuff. I'm gonna load it up on the truck. Truck's way over there on the other side of that shed. And the uh, one new machine we got, I just been trying to work with it a little bit, and I just I don't like it, folks. Uh -oh, I'm not on. Um, hello. There we go. Get turned back around. Now, if I had the joysticks, this would work a whole lot better. And, um, uh, I do have a, uh, Amazon link. If any of y'all feeling generous. <laughs> yeah, um... I don't blame you if you don't feel them that way, folks. These things are expensive. Joysticks went from $114 up to $181 the last I checked. I'm like, did they just up that because it was in, you know, uh oh, I got switch back to that. And I just, there we go. Grind the stump, baby. There we go. Raise you back up, shut you off. Switch back to my claw. Let's just go ahead and turn around here without hitting his fence, preferably. Uh, this is done, so for cleaning the mess up. And while we're doing this, I just want to say thank you, folks, for all the love and support y'all been given. Uh, watch time's up. That's a good thing, right? And uh, yeah, I just I just love all the comments. Y'all show me so much love, and uh, I might be a little late on returning that love, but I'm trying to get to y'all just in case I am behind at recording this or something. Let's do that there. By the way, this is the new head that we updated to. Oh, that thing's so much quiet. Better. Uh, he updated the head. It looks less to it, but it does a whole lot better. It's got the two grind, the two wheels here that helps pull it through in that wheel. My uh, new saw right there. And the grabber up there. It, it just it works awesome, folks. I love FDR logging mods, as you can tell. Uh, they're not paying me to say that, but yeah, I just you know when something works good. You, you, you shout them out and as you can see over there it's probably going to be our thumbnail um yeah this this thing right here i love it but let's go in here play with it a little bit start it up raise that up just see right there 
as it turns. I wish that was a little bit slower because when you're turning and stuff, trying to load logs, it, it, it gets a little bit tricky when you're, it's like needs to be slowed down. I wish you go in and individually set each motion. And his machines don't slide. Watch, I'll turn like this. See how it's sliding machine? It's not doing that on his maps and stuff. It's just something with GoCrest. Or it might be my computer. It might be the graphics or something. But yeah, this this here I'm not quite used to it. I'm gonna have to get practice on it. Um, so it's nothing against his logs, uh, logs, <laughs> his mods. You, you go check out his link. It's this FDR logging. Uh, you, you type in on YouTube, it will show it, no problem. It, it's got a tension belt. I don't know if you can see it in there or not. You can kind of see it right there. Yeah, you can see it good there. A little tension belt you can lock and that helps um you see how I, i'm doing it i gotta go kind of step by step he he's got the joysticks and he makes it look so much easier Maybe you just take tension belts. Whoa, whoa, wrong way, wrong way, Mr. Blue. There you go, because I'm not. Yeah, he can do it all so smooth. But of course, he's got more playtime with them and stuff than I do. But yeah, that's, that's that. And I got the stump grinder on it too for uh, cleanup afterwards. Like if there's just some baby pieces laying around, we can just grind those up. Uh-oh. Can I lift this? Probably not. Uh, uh. Whoa. Okay. It, it'd probably go when we start loading. But this thing here, I like it pretty good. I can get up to it. Mm. Oh, don't throw it. Of course, I'm still getting the plow. I got a grinder on it just in case we're at a different job site. I just got the chains on it for better support on the on the logs here, but oh, not logs, but on the grass and. For the ones that's new, don't know too much about this, it's this, you can kind of back up to this pile here. I'm gonna get in the middle. Back on up here. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be kind of off. See, I just messed up, I was back completely over my pile. It's all right though, we got an auto load trailer, so. It's you just uh, you can turn it left or right, turn it all the way around if you want to. Don't wiggle my way down in here. Don't want to get too big of a bite. You just want just barely like that right there. The harder you squeeze it, the more they're gonna log out at you or something. But yeah, that's that right there. See if we can go down through here and uh oh, losing a couple. I'm not too good at driving this right yet, but now we're just gonna take it, drop it right here. We're gonna drop it like it's hot. Open that up. And let the belt go, and voila. We dumped them right there. Ooh, almost hit his fence. 
but let me get some of this cleaned up and uh i'll be right back folks all right folks we got it all cleaned up got it loaded up got the uh porter bronc whatever it's called back there loaded on the truck and uh we're going to drive course stop at the next and that will take us to the sawmill and we're going to do the same thing oh almost not myself cuckoo things leaning just a little bit on the hill there but it should be all right you know gonna come back get the uh skitter there take it back to the sawmill and then uh we're going to take our harvester there to the farm and do some harvesting there now we might have to pass our own truck i ain't doing some rocking but yeah, we'll get uh, 50000 for doing that little bit of a contract, which he thought was a good price, so I was going to stick with it. Now, the 50000 will go to the farm shop, or to the farm count, and what we make off those logs up there will go towards the sawmill bank account, getting us out of debt, so... But folks, I guess that's going to be it for this episode. We're going to get these guys to the sawmill and call it uh, the morning half. Now there'll probably be one more episode in the in the evening time of this day, and I'll be us doing some work around the farm and hopefully harvesting when that field gets ready. Oh, at least he's taking it slow. He's taking it slow. Right, I'm going to pull over real quick. I know I said it was in there, but let's check something out real quick. Uh, oh, nope. Wrong. Oh, oh, oh. Wrong buttons. Wrong buttons. Uh, we want to go into harvesters. We're going to go over here to the modded harvesters. I, I, I'm thinking about that in there, I'm not for sure. It's either going to be a case or, or New Holland. Oh, no, no, no. Wish we could afford a John Deere. Uh, did I not have it in here? I don't guess I have it. Oh, it might, might be a John Deere. might be this in here. The smaller one. I don't have that new Holland one in. I guess I don't have it installed. Or there, they got rid of it. But it's kind of like this in here is just a little bit different. Then again, we might go with that. Never know. Never know, folks. Till next time. Oh, he, he done. hit the road on me. But, folks, I will see y'all next time. All right, y'all. I appreciate every everything y'all do, all the comments, the love and stuff. This um, might be a day or two before y'all see this, so uh, sorry for the gap in between the videos. There he is. But uh, yeah, I'll be back in there, here and there. So y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Later.